again, it slightly behooves me, if you'll allow me to use those words, that the Zoro would make their home in the mountains, and not like in the previous games where like the Zoro- well, I guess they were kind of in the mountains too. But they had like a whole underwater kingdom as well. Behooves, I tell you, behooves. It behoomst- behoomst me. See, this is the- the play pool for the babies, this is the shallow. This is the kiddie pool. There's a lot of pee in this water. But now it's freezing. You, giant beluga. I've- I've got good news. <laughs> Link, you did well to sur- Oh shit, suddenly every Zora. There is no longer any danger of a great flood laying waste to Hyrule. You appease the divine beast, Varuta. Thusly saved oh, Zora's domain. Link, I must reward your efforts. Now then, I implore you to collect the treasure hidden in that inside that chest over there. It's not really hidden in there, it's just kind of in there. By the way, Link, I see you are without your trusty blade. The sword that seals the darkness. Did you perhaps lose it when you lost your memory? What sword? Hmm, so you have forgotten that as well. That is a legendary blade that only you, the Hylian Champion, can wield. It is no doubt resting somewhere in Hyrule, even now, waiting for its master to return. As your father, I am proud of you for fighting the Divine Beast alongside Link. You have grown much recently. I know you will be a worthy heir when your time comes. Wait a minute. They're two different species. How'd that happen? Sidon is so much s smaller. How glorious. Truly splendid. Wow. <laughs> Link, this is wonderful. Couldn't go five minutes in a side-on conversation without that pose. This calls for a top-tier expression of gratitude. A pose! It's okay, I'm definitely not just in it for the rupees and the sick loot. I want the approval of fish creatures flapping their fins at me. Ah, fine, I guess I'll take it. Spear of peerless grace cherished by the Zora King, Mif a champion Mifa. Although Mifa specializes in healing abilities, her spearmanship was in a class all its own. Now, all of the water in this new Zora's domain doesn't flow through your butt crack, does it, King? Because if so, we'd have to have a word. I guess we can go back to being a fish a little bit longer. Because that was kind of cool. Ha! Why is it that most kings have to do stuff like that? Like, <laughs> Ho! Oh! Can we- can we not have a king that does that in just one medieval video game? That's why I like the Bloody Baron from The Witcher. Dude was a real creepo. Well, then again, he wasn't a king. Oh, now the sky's the limit. I could do whatever I want. And now, the real fun begins. No longer the dawn. We can explore Upper Fish Kingdom. Uh, however, I am going to get rid of this club. We gotta show it to the... child. To the boar. Uh, people are memeing about, uh, the prequels. I don't know why that's happening. It's not like everyone's memeing about the prequels lately. But, I did watch... the most recent episodes of Rebels. Says so someone in chat who's gonna do the, the disgusted face. I get it. You don't like the art style. I understand. However, genuinely, some good episodes this season, and... there's a moment when there's a droid out in space singing a song... that I'm not gonna spoil that I actually started laughing out loud for. It was... incredible. But, um... Yeah, some pretty, pretty good stuff. It has, it has some really good moments in it. And next, uh, ne the next episode... Obi-Wan versus Darth Maul. It's not a spoiler. They've been showing all the trailers, or at least that's what I think is going to happen. So, I'm excited. Maybe they can finally, like, stop putting Darth Maul in things. Yes, for those that have never watched all the other stuff and just saw the prequels. Darth Maul was indeed alive after that fall, and he got spider legs in the Clone Wars TV show. Then he got some comics, and then he got, like, mechanical people legs. It's all very strange. But he actually turned out to be a decent character. It's not completely just anger and, and, and face fuck. Whatever that means. Hey. Hmm. Oh. Is that... The Moblin Club? Nice, nice. Let me see it. Not that impressive. It's pretty much just a giant, shitty amalgam of wood and handle. It's even more amazing than I imagined. I don't know, the Fire Rod was even better than this, in my opinion. Next weapon is... 
Oh, yeah, that one. That one. <laughs> the duplex bow. No, I don't know. You can get one around here. Fellers, where you get that duplex bow? That's not this area. That's a little bit later. Okay. So we, we just will get it later then. Well, let's go see Pura. Let's go see Pure. Ha! Huh. I, I love stupid Zelda voices that only say one thing. Oh! Thank you! So, are you guys snowed in? Anyone else snowed in? I mean, I'm not really snowed in. I could leave, but I don't really feel like it. Let's see, a few people are. Some people got 24 inches. Oh, we didn't quite get that much. Yeah, we- well, some people. Some people actually genuinely got snowed in. Like, they canceled public schools and they issued a big warning. And it was a pretty nasty blizzard from my understanding, but we didn't- here in New York City, at the very least, we didn't get, like, the most snow ever. Okay, we upgrade stasis time. Yes. I like the minimalist kind of piano stuff for a lot of the songs in this game. Like the Guardian theme and a lot of the little jingles, it's just piano. <laughs> Love it. What's this? Perhaps you already went and powered them all up. Well, I suppose you see Sheikah Slate and your legendary swordsmanship. With them, we have nothing to fear. Yes, quite nothing at all. Not even Calamity Ganon. Well, you probably still want to worry about that a little bit. I'm kind of curious. What, what, what's this other picture you're selling here? Oh, that's the... Okay, I see. That's just one of the ones I'm missing. There's only one left from that category anyway. So you just get a random one. Which means the fact that I didn't take a picture of that boss is going to be a little bit annoying. Just a little bit. Very annoying. A little very annoying. Well, I guess it depends on whether or not I'm going to be 100%ing this game. That remains to be seen. I usually let my disgust with playing a video game for too long dictate whether or not I keep playing it. It's kind of just a natural thing. So who knows, maybe the game will keep my interest until I get 100%. Maybe not. Maybe go fuck yourself. If I do 100%, I'm not gonna be streaming it, obviously. I'm just gonna be doing the main stuff. And then like maybe every now and then we can do a, um, a random stream of me just getting stuff. I'm not gonna draw this out until like 2018. I had to think about what year we were in for a minute. So, apples plus, uh, herb. <laughs> Stain fruit. Just experimenting. I don't mind experimenting. Hasty simmered fruit. Make a cake. Son, you saying I can make cakes in this game? Alright, let's see. I'm just gonna assume that you make a cake with eggs, milk, <laughs> um, lizards. And, uh, an Octorok tentacle, of course, is how you make a good cake. Look at those nice ingredients. Oh, yeah. Yeah, put the bottle in. Hasty elixir. Huh. It actually kind of worked. That's what's great about the cooking in this. You can do a combination of the stupidest ingredients and you'll still get something edible. Or interesting. Or you might find something amazing. So, like, I want to add, um, apples and radish. Damn, that is a good one. That is a really good one. Those radishes are no joke. Just see what happens. Five radish. Jesus! Plus 15?! What?! Apples and mushrooms are very common. They can be combined. I mean, those are... Those, that's a perfectly serviceable meal. For me. I don't have a ton of hearts, so I don't end up wasting better stuff. But I do have, um... Let's see what we got here. One of each of the meats with a little salt and some nutty acorn, yeah? Put a little bit of fucking acorn in the meat, yeah? Fucking Christ. Season it. Yeah. Maybe this is- this might be an omelette. No, just a waste of eggs. Mushroom, apple, thing. Just, just craziness. Everything. Let's try it. one, two, one, two, and then we need some kind of um, additive, like the herb. That makes a better steamed mushrooms. Milk plus rice. Let's see. 
milk. It's okay. <laughs> All right. Just salt. Let me waste my salt just for the sake of appeasing the audience. Ugh. Oh, you idiots. You- you ter- you terrible idiots, how dare you! Let's face it, I'm the real idiots. Yeah, some salt fried salt. Salt plus flint? You fucking leave my stream if you're suggesting I do salt plus flint. I would have done it too if I had more room. So here's the duck. The Hylian duck. And it's natural habitat. It's the bright-chested duck. Planet Earth 2. And now we can demonstrate the corkscrew. No, we're not gonna demonstrate the corkscrew on planet Hyrule. No way. Some nice armor over here. It's a little expensive and I'm saving up for a house. So, that's not gonna happen just yet. But I, I got my eye on it. Oh, right, you're... You yeah. like the corner, I remember now. Do you wanna buy some... Garbage? Eh, you want some salt fried salt? Actually, which of my meals sells for the most? Mighty Seafood Skewer sells for quite a bit. You could just cook and make money off of cooking, if you really want to. I'm sure there's like, an optimal, in, like, you know, set of things that you could make. Yeah, I'm sure someone's figured it out. Do I really need this many amber and opal? At any point, am I gonna need 54? I'm not selling monster parts for rupees, I know. Gems? Yeah, but don't you need these for ever- People, I've gotten different responses about these. You will need a bunch of amber. Alright, so... Here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna sell some of this shit. Look at that. I can already afford the house. I can afford the armor now, too. Even if I just sell a small percentage of each of my gems, that is perfect. And I could sell, like, 10 amber. We'll get more of this stuff, and if not, then I could just play on my own and go find it. I don't mind. It, it is not a chore to play this game. That's right, I need this. I need to be electrocuted. Give me the electrocution gear, please. True story, from what I read, if you use a weapon of a certain element on one of those, um, deposits, I'm not sure if it's the luminous deposit or just a regular ore deposit, you will get the st the gem of the corresponding element. So fire, amber, etc. Am I slower? I can't tell. Hi. People who lack clothes just love it here at Ventus Clothing. I lack clothes. Does this make you uncomfortable? Well, it looks cool. And with upgrades, it's probably very cool. Probably has set bonuses too. And it'll get me nice and electrocuted. I've always wanted to get electrocuted. Alright, I was told to, uh... Do something here. Whoa, my! Aren't you perky? Well then. It's not... It's wood, it's everywhere. Hang on a minute. But yeah, well, I know. <laughs> Wood's everywhere. How do you know that? Alright, well. It's time to cut down some trees with a sledgehammer. <laughs> Never thought to do that before. Not surprisingly, doesn't work. I guess I was kind of hoping that with enough effort, Link could just, like, fucking strong-arm the tree to fall over. I mean, he's- look how strong he is. He's, he's wearing this fucking massive armor. He's not even slowed down that much. Or at all, I'm not sure. Do you really want to fuck with a dude in full plate mail? I think I have enough by now. Like, I'm actually really liberal with my weapons because I just want to get rid of them so I can replace them with more ones. Because there's just so many weapons in the game. So I have no problem just wasting my weapons a bit when they get broken. I also have all these bows, too. I want to save the, the bow that shoots three arrows at once because it is pretty fucking cool. Press one if you like to collect wood in this game. Press two if you think this is like Minecraft. Press three if you want to create a new chat topic. Alright, we're halfway to Titty City. Now we just gotta go back and give the wood to that guy- <laughs> To that feller. Yeah, ever since I watched diners, drive-ins, and dumpsters while I was at PAX. It's just, uh, fucking Guy Fieri's- Why do I keep calling him Fieri? 
Cause he- that's how he pronounces his name. No. No, I'm not giving that to him. His name is Guy Fieri. The dude's voice and trash eating was just in my dreams. So now- now I can't stop thinking about the Triple D. That show's dangerous. It makes me want to eat, like, crap food. You know, when I watch some er other people, like, some other cooking stuff, it makes me want to eat better. Nope. Not for him. He makes me want to go out and eat, like, a fucking triple bypass jalapeno, bacon, pulled pork, beef burger, with a side of- of fucking lard. Mm. Hey! <laughs> Here's your wood. Okie do. I'll grab them from you. <laughs> oh, all I need to see. Good faith wood. That's right. So as promised, I'll sell you this old house. What's good faith wood again? Why, why are we? Also, is it just me or is that dude dude's head in the background shaped rather like a bulbous onion? The low price of three thousand rupees. Once you get the money together, come grab me. Grab me, he says. Well, I'm I'm grabbing. I'm ready. Take my money. No way! Talk about studly. <laughs> I'll just take that off your hands! Such a sweet investment, spending so much money on anything at your age. It's just so... studly. Everyone wants to bone Link in this game. The fish... <laughs> Zelda... <laughs> There's a weapon mount in there that never sold. Consider it a housewarming gift. So, next job time, baby. What have I lined up again? Oh yeah, that's what what's next. I was going to send Hudson up a call away to clear some land. Okay. Well, here's my shitty empty house. Yeah, one of the reasons I wanted this house was the weapon display. Pretty cool. I think you get more. I don't know how to get them. Apparently the light scale trident does get repaired, or you can get more of them. So I'll just put that there for now. I can't wait for people to come into the house and steal my stuff. Yeah. What are you doing? Taking a break? Mm -hmm. By the way, did you buy that house? Yes. Impressive. You're just a pup. Uh, come again? Don't worry about it anyway. <laughs> what? Looks like I've gotta head out and leave this place soon. Why? I've been transferred. Transferred? Might have heard, but Bolson Construction's planning to expand big time. That's great. Yeah, big expansion. Where will you go? So our domain is north of here. We're going north of that, though. An area called the Akala region. It's pretty far. Yeah. Well. Good luck! Okay, then. Akala? Akala Island? Is this Pokemon? Well, no time like the present, right? I should get going on my way. If you'd like, you should come to the Akala region and say hello. Well, take care of yourselves. Goodbye, my carpenter friend. My homies. I will see you again. When the sun rises from the west. Yeah, we're going up up north. I'm going to expand. We're going to expand. You want to expand with us? You can expand. I don't care. I guess that's where I'll go next. Just follow the uh, yellow brick road. I definitely would like more display stuff for the house, though. Because I'm, uh, I'm a bit of a hoarder with weapons sometimes. Oh, that dude sells furniture. The one that sold me the house. The one who called me a stud. I'll be back. I see Link's girlfriend real quick. Give me that. Give me that Fieri! Alright, I call this the Monster Mozzarella Burger with Jalapeno shit. Got some pretty good enhancements. Shame I can't just enhance all at once. But yeah, this makes um, this armor much more worthwhile. Mm. <laughs> just skipping the cutscene. We've seen it so many times. There's only so many jokes you can make about a giant fairy blowing you before it gets old. So, but for those that have no idea what I'm talking about, I, I feel like I have to now show the cutscene once. That's. That's really what happens, I wasn't lying. I mean, it's just so- it's just so obvious, it's just- I mean, talk about low-hanging fruit. Haha. <laughs> Great fruit. Do you live under wa- are you an angel? And do you live underwater? How do you breathe underwater? Tell me your secrets. So I'm, uh, at 21 at the moment, and if I wear- the, cha <laughs> the champion's tunic. I am now at 22. 
So, technically, the champion's tunic is still the highest defense I have. However, I mean, I'll take the one minus defense if I'm using these because they just look cool together. I mean, that does look cool. Link has some pretty fucking snazzy outfits in this game. I really like what the designers did. I mean, Link went from wearing like one or two or three outfits per game to a fuckload, and they all look awesome. Well, so far. I mean, I'm sure there's gonna be some that look like fecal matter, but we'll, we'll find that out. And you can dye them, too. So if you really wanted to, you can look like fucking Assassin from Assassin's Creed. That's his name, right? And also, uh, Michael Fajbender, who's played him in the movie. Hello, my name is East Michael Fajbender. Fajbender. And I'm here to show you the new elephant on the loading screen. There it is up there. Show me your wares. You don't even have to say it. Oh, wow, I just bought a house and it's totally empty and depressing. Sure. That's you to a T. I see it in your eyes. Yep. I was just like you about a lifetime ago. So tell you what. Let me help you by taking care of furniture or the exterior or anything really for 5,000 rupees. Actually, no, scratch that for you. Let's start at 100 rupees. Just cruise on when I buy whenever you have the spending cash and we'll talk. I'm... Let's do this. Exterior crocodile alligator. I'm gonna sign with my name on it for 100 ruples. It's probably one of the worst things I could get. Totally pointless. Hi. Cars. <laughs> we are on. Oh. The noises. <laughs> this game is gonna be like legendary for the. For the character noises. Link's house. Okay. That was a hundred. One hundred rupees. Um. Oh, yeah. Door would be nice for. Are we studs of stud work? You're darn tootin' we are! I'm ready for... Gear display. Um... Let's see, I can upgrade the shit out of this house. Just gotta find rupees. Wow, rupees are actually useful in this Zelda game. Crazy. Which shield? I mean, there's just... Look at this, I have the Hylian shield. I could put the Hylian shield in the house if I really wanted to, but I'm gonna keep it with me just in case. Let's do another weapon mount, and then I'll stop upgrading for now. Recall that time you dazzled me? Well, it's dazzling time again, babe. Baby. I like Carson is so eager to please his mass- his friend. His boss. I mean, eventually I'll get a bed. Link has no time to sleep. That looks like such poop! Oh man, that looks like- Garbage. Put that, man, that looks kind of awesome. I'm not gonna bring it with me. Eventually, I'll use it. Put the leaf up there. Yeah, weapon mount for a leaf. 